What's up YouTube, Dylan here. Today I'll be showing you how we installed this chainsaw holder for our Kubota tractor. This one is from Extreme Metal Products, the Haul Your Saw. Here are the parts that came in the kit. Got a few nuts and bolts for attaching it to the tractor and then a handful of smaller nuts and bolts to attach the pieces together. The three pieces of sheet metal get sandwiched between the bolts. So the one with the flange goes against the ground then the flat one and the saw shaped one goes on the top. Then you take the shorter black nuts and bolts, stick them through all the holes. We opted to tighten them up with an impact and a wrench. The next thing we did was install the clamp handle. That fits on the four studs that stick out of the front and gets four of those same size nuts. The socket didn't fit over these, so we ended up having to tighten them all down with a wrench. The other thing we did is cut out some rubber strips that will fit in between the two sides of the clamp. That way we don't scratch the paint on our tractor. The screw in the clamp arm adjusts the tension. For now, we just tighten that down some, and then we'll do the final adjustment once it's on the tractor, and we can put a saw in it. Over on the tractor, all we need to do is install the two large bolts through the outside holes on the clamps on either side of the loader arm. Our kit had one long and one short bolt, and we ended up needing two long bolts, so we had to go dig for one in the barn. The last thing we needed to do was add a saw and adjust the tension on the clamp arm. This ended up being a lot easier with pliers and a wrench instead of trying to use a screwdriver bit and a wrench.